just hit me with those brown eyes Welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you my everyday makeup routine. I filmed this video just over a year ago now. It's my second video on my channel and it's about time I basically update it. So without further ado, let's get started. I have just pinned back my hair and I also have just washed my face. First thing I'm going to do is actually apply some moisturiser. This is the Olay Regenerous Moisturiser. I really like the stuff. I think it's a really nice thick moisturiser and it definitely keeps my face all nice and hydrated and moisturised throughout the day because I do have quite naturally dry skin so I feel like it also plumps my skin a little bit as well so I'm going to apply a little bit of that to my face also if you're wondering why I'm looking down there that's where my mirror is um, so I probably will be doing that quite a lot in this video next thing I'm going to do is just apply some lip balm this is just like a cheap lip balm from Poundland I need to find like a good lip balm but I normally just use this one from Poundland. It is a job. It's probably not the best lip balm out there, but it keeps my lips moisturized, so I'm not complaining too much. The next thing I'm going to use is the Glossier Future Dew oil serum this is probably one of my favorite things ever if you haven't used this already i honestly recommend you use it and try it out i think i used this product in my last makeup routine it's just so good it's basically like a oil serum and it makes your skin all nice and glowy and it also like really illuminates the face really nicely as well so i'm going to do a couple pumps and just pretty much apply that to my skin i normally try to go to like the high points of my skin first and then just kind of put it or dot it anywhere else to be honest doesn't have to be this way I don't know if you can see but it gives like a really nice like subtle glow which I honestly really do love so the next thing I'm going to do is apply my foundation of choice it's the L'Oreal Paris True Match Nude Plumping Tinted Serum and I've just been using this recently and I really really like it I've literally seen people on TikTok use it and it looks amazing on them I don't really like anything too thick or cakey on my face I like something more simple and more lightweight and more natural looking so this is perfect because it's really glowy it's like a nice natural serum and it just makes your face look really nice give it a bit of coverage but it's not full coverage put a couple of drops on my hands i know it looks crazy right now i'm gonna use my beauty sponge just to blend it in i don't have to wash away the pain with like a courage now that is all nicely blended in now i'm gonna go in with some concealers these are both the maybelline fit me concealers and depending on the day sometimes i just want a concealer type of day sometimes i want a bit more coverage so i use both of them depending on how i'm feeling but today i'm going to use obviously both the products i do have the shade 15 and 25 the shade 15 i normally use under my eyes or anywhere around my face where i need to brighten it up a little bit and then shade 25 i normally use on any spots or blemishes just to like conceal it a little bit more good courage like a courage, I like the scourge, I like, like the scourge now Then I'm just going to use my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder This is one of my all-time favourite powders because it's cheap and it does a job I'm stunning to think it doesn't have to be the Next thing I'm going to apply is my blush This is the Milani Luminoso blush This is my all-time favourite powder blush I honestly love the colour of the blush It's such a pretty like coral colour And it's also got like slight shimmers in there which is so so beautiful To be this way I don't have to wash the way the pain with liquid courage, lick, liquid courage, I lick the skin. It's so pretty, it adds like a really nice like pop of colour to the cheeks which I really really like. Next thing I'm going to use is my all time favourite highlighter, it's the Glossier Halo Scoop in the shade Quartz. It's so so good, it's basically like a cream highlighter. Mine honestly has seen better days, like it's looking kind of rough, but I honestly love this stuff. I think if you haven't tried this product either, I definitely recommend you give it a go because it is so, so good. I like the scourge, like the scourge, huh? you know. Now I'm just going to move on to my lashes. I don't really do anything to my brows because it, I don't know, I'm not really too fussed about my brows, like I don't really care what they look like. Do I need to kind of pluck some hairs away from them? Yes, of course. Do I really want to do that right now? No, not really. So I'm going to go ahead and do my lashes. <laughs> use my all-time favorite mascara is the benefit bad girl bang mascara i honestly need to find like a cheap alternative because this is like 24 pounds a tube and i asked for this for christmas last time i think I was using it sparingly until next christmas because i don't really want to waste 24 pounds on a tube of mascara even though it is really good it's just a bit too much personally you know what I've been through. It feels like 
And the last thing for my makeup routine is just a little bit of clear lip gloss on my lips. This is my clear lip gloss from Primark. It was clear. It's now like kind of gone all like slightly pink, which is kind of gross, but I think it was like bound to happen anyways. This is my makeup look. It's honestly super simple and super glowy and it is on the natural side because I don't really like wearing like full glam every single day. Not like I wear makeup every single day anyways, but it's just one, it just seems so much effort and two, it's just not for me personally. That is it for this week's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please make sure to like, subscribe and turn on your post notifications. I post every Tuesday at 6 p.m. GMT. I really appreciate it if you subscribe and I'll see you in next week's video. Bye.